A possible wolf attack in North Idaho has left one dog dead and neighbors on edge. The attack happened Wednesday just outside of Wallace in the backyard of a home. KXY4's Annie Bishop joins us live on the sky deck. Annie, what happened? Well, we know a Rottweiler was killed on Wednesday, but what, uh, what animal was responsible for that is up for debate. Now, neighbors are convinced it was a wolf pack. However, Fish and Game isn't so sure. It's a bit scary. When your backyard includes hundreds of acres of dense forest, wolves and other wildlife are part of the deal. But recently, neighbors say a wolf pack has been getting too close for comfort. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're like right behind the house. Tara Martin says she hears the animals several times a week. I don't like anyone being out here by themselves at night. And on Wednesday. Gunfire, yelling and screaming, hollering. I mean, it was just a commotion. I mean, I heard sitting right here. All of it. Her neighbor's dogs were attacked. One Rottweiler died and another dog received bite wounds to the face. Uh, at this point, it's inconclusive exactly what made the attack. Uh, the landowner had seen uh, some animals up in the brush close by, um, but none of the tracks are the size of a wolf. So it's really inconclusive exactly what attacked and killed the dog. Phil Cooper with Idaho Fish and Game says the Rottweiler was taken to a local veterinarian who couldn't tell if the bite wounds were from another dog or wolf. Cooper says there are wolf packs in the area. Wolves do attack dogs. There's no question about it. I think it's probably more of a territorial um, aggression rather than a predatory instinct. Even though Cooper can't say with certainty wolves are responsible, he does urge pet owners to take precautions, such as keeping your dogs inside or in a kennel. Just keep your pets, your kids inside and, you know, I mean, if you have to defend yourself, I think you have every right to defend your animals and your um, family. And in Idaho, it is legal to shoot a wolf if it is threatening yourself, your family, or your pets. Reporting live, Annie Bishop, KXLY4 HD News. Thank you.